Some of the new stabilized receivers like the Archer Plus SR10 Plus, the TD SR12, TD SR18, and TW SR12 currently require a temporary Lewis grip to be installed to the radio. To do that, first bring up your web browser and go to the FreeSky website at frsky-rc.com. To find the downloads for the Lewis script, you can currently find them under the Archer SR10 Plus. So I'll go to 2.4 gigahertz access. And I'll choose the Archer Plus SR10 Plus. And then I'll go to the download section. Here you can see the Lua script for Ethos. So I will download it now. You should see it pop up in the top right corner here and you can click open file. And inside of this is a folder called scripts that needs to be copied to the X20 or the Ethos system. The easiest way to do that is through bootloader mode. So I'll hold down the navigation wheel while I press the on button to put it to bootloader mode. And then I'll connect it by USB to my computer. You should see USB connected on the radio system and you'll have a few windows pop up on the screen. You can just ignore the one that has bitmaps and fonts you do not need to touch this drive ever. This is the internal radio firmware. On the other drive that has the audio bitmaps and models, you'll see there's a scripts folder. This may or may not exist on your system. From the zip file that you downloaded before, you can click and drag the file to your USB drive or you can right click and copy and then from the root you can paste it to check that they're installed correctly in the scripts folder you should see the following two scripts available now that that's done i'll eject the drive to make sure that the files are written correctly and now I can disconnect the radio system. Once you've copied the scripts onto the X20, you can power the system down and reboot it normally. Welcome to Ethos. Fail safe, not set. Switch warning. I'll plug in my receiver, which I've already bound. Now, most people would expect to see the new Lua's load under the device config, but that's not the case. Instead, to access the temporary Lua scripts, which you've installed, you do that from the uh, system setup or the radio setup under the gear icon or press the system button. And then you can swipe the screen over or use the page button and be able to access the new stabilized Lua scripts, which you've installed. To configure the new stabilization systems, I'll go to the appropriate Lua script. In this case, for the Archer Plus, it's the SRX Stable. When you launch it, you'll have option to turn on and off the stabilization, perform the self check, to turn on and off quick mode, or change the wing type. You can also adjust all the gains for all the stabilized channels. And to access the secondary stable system, you press the page button and it will take you to the stable system too, which you can turn on or off as well.